sorry I look crazy. I still kind of feel like death. Um, anyways, and my shirt's a little bit off as far as where my intercostal lines would probably be realistically. Um, you're going to want to start with <clears throat> the two. You're going to place one on each or one on each wrist and then one right above the ankle right here. Um, wide is right. That's kind of how I remember it. Um, and then after that, you're going to continue with the one, which is going to go near the sternum in the fourth intercostal space. V2 is going to go directly across. As you can tell, my shirt's not exactly even. <laughs> I tried. Um, and then you're going to want to do V4 next, possibly. It's going to go um, midclavicular in the fifth intercostal space. And you're going to put V3 directly in between V2 and V4. Um, after that, you're basically going to stair step B V5 and 6. Um, as you can see right here, um, on the left <clears throat> side in the fifth intercostal space, um, anterior with the axillary line. So you're just going to kind of stair step out like that. And that's where all your electrodes go, unless you need your patient to have movement. And in that case, you're going to want to put your, um, your white and black and then down here. Your red and green. So that's where they go.